what's up YouTube welcome to another awesome video here on Royal Brick Studios and today in this video we're gonna be uh, looking at set 41611 Marty McFly and Doc Brown this is 240 pieces and is ages 10 and up so we have number 43 Marty McFly and 44 Doc Brown uh, with just the classic brick wall there uh, the two brick heads uh, which look absolutely amazing um, then we have the uh, actually some really cool artwork here uh, to the out of time license plate on the back of the DeLorean and the Back to the Future logo as well as the printed tile and the Lego consumer information so uh, the box did get a little dented not too much damage um, but I say we should get right into this so if you haven't already please hit that subscribe button we're uh, going for 500 subscribers within the first five weeks of this channel and um, I would like to do that um, so that way, uh, just for my channel and give it a little boost, um, we're already only a couple weeks in, so we've got a good bit of time to do that. Um, also, um, we're trying to do uh, a good bit of views. We're trying to get uh, plenty of views for my channel as well. Uh, so if you haven't already, you go on ahead and hit that like button and the subscribe button and hit the notification bell for uh, um with all my awesome content. So let's get right into here, bag one and bag two, and the instructions. Uh, and that's it in the box. Normally in the uh, Brickhead's boxes they get the um, tiles, the plates that they sit on, in a separate, but you know, whatever. Uh, so here we go, bag one. Looks like Marty McFly, so we'll build him first. And then bag two. Uh, this is Dr. Brown, so we'll build those uh, next. And then the instructions here for Doc Brown. Uh, with the Go Brick Me ad. And then we have Marty McFly uh, with just the win. So we'll uh, go on ahead and get right into building this. Um, so definitely really excited about this. Um, I was looking for this set uh, for a little while ever since it came out, and I finally found it at Target. Uh, if you watch that haul video, I think it's haul number two, you'll uh, hear me explain about it uh, a little bit more in detail. Alright, so you just now saw the build, and uh, now we have the completed uh, Marty McFly and Doc Brown. And I just have to say, they look spectacular. I think they're probably the best brickheads I've ever built. And I, I know I say that with every brickhead I built, like, but these are my favorite. I mean, like, they get better every single one I build. Um, definitely my two favorite ones aren't here. Uh, definitely putting these on display, but first I figured I'd go on with the review. Uh, so you saw the box opening, the box break, and the uh, uh, time-lapse video. Uh, so let's go on ahead and review. I want to do this uh, quickly. Uh, so we have Marty McFly here. And uh, what's really interesting is the way they did uh, his vest, uh, which uh, they used the special um, tile right there. And then just took a one-by-one -one tile and put it on. And it looks really good, actually. Um... I think they did really good on that. Uh, the hair is uh, pretty simple, but it looks great. Uh, the camera is probably my favorite part right here. Uh, I like how they did this camera. Very simple, but it looks really good. Uh, it's just three pieces, and yet it looks like a real camera. Um, and then the back with the rest of the vest and his jeans, it looks great. Uh, really love this brickheads right here. And uh, then the Doc Brown, this one I did have some difficulties with, uh, the hair, definitely. Uh, it was definitely a, a different build, like if I take off the face, uh, they didn't do the second layer there. Of the, you, you know, I just, re I'm, I'm holding Doc Brown's face here, and is that not creepy? Like, here, let me just take off his face. No, anyways, uh, they didn't do the second layer of the uh, gray 1x2 special plates. Um... So, you know what I'm going to do just for fun? I'm going to... Never, never mind. Just... Never mind. That was just too funny. Uh, 
Uh, and then the uh, remote control here. Uh, they actually gave me an extra one of this clear piece right here. Uh, very happy about that. Uh, so I can use that in my own collection. Um, but it looks very nice. It's very cool. Uh, the DeLorean remote control for when he got it to go 88 miles per hour in the test with Einstein it. Um, so it looks great. He's got the great detailing there um, with his vest. And then on the back here with the um, nuclear radioactive warning logo. The hair looks good. It's a um, definitely very shaggy, I guess. It's uh, a lot of pieces there. This one was probably a little harder to build than Marty McFly, but you know, not too difficult. Um, but yeah, definitely. I really love these brick heads. I think they're probably my favorite ones I've built so far. And this could definitely pass off as a Comic-Con brick heads. In fact, like the whole time I was building it, and the way they look, and the way they designed it, it, it looks like it could be a Comic-Con exclusive. Um, I'm glad it's not. Because now it's available for the public to buy. Um, so I'm quite happy with that. So if you haven't already, go on ahead and hit that subscribe button. We're going for 500 subscribers within the first five weeks of this channel. So uh, thank you for watching and be sure to check out uh, my uh, other content.